Hey you guys, so if you have not noticed, yes, I'm wearing the same clothes as my previous last few product reviews because we do a lot. Yeah, we doing a lot. So going forward with the oldie but goodie product reviews, we have the Jamaican Mango and Lime Locking Gel. Now you guys, I was able to locate this product at my local fries, which is, which is Kroger's in the Midwest and South. So let's just jump right into this. This is six ounces. It says on the container, starts and maintains lock and twist naturally, long lasting hold, no buildup key no build up because this is a jelly like consistency now i've dipped in this a few times um i used it to lay down jb's edges <laughs> i'm so sorry i used this to lay down my child edges and i also used this to set my twists um i've been wearing my hair you guys since we've been quarantining I haven't changed much. I've been wearing my hair in twists for like two to three weeks and I've been using this product. So it smells really good. One of the few products, personally, I would prefer products with no scents. Unscented products is right up my alley. Um, but this product does have a nice scent, smell to it. So it's the color of a mango. This is the consistency. It's like a mango color. And it is a jelly-like consistency. Extremely affordable. And when I mean extremely affordable, I got this on sale for under five bucks. Winning, you cannot look, winning. So what I'm gonna do with this product, I'm looking for a cute spring-like look. Now y'all, I cannot flat twist to save my life. You know those flat twists they do where they port their hair in the front, the back, you know, it's all the way down, it's symmetric. No, we, we can't do that. I can't do that, I'm just gonna be honest with you. Now I'm gonna attempt attempt to do my version of flat twists and then we're gonna add perm rods to get this curly curly look okay all right you guys so i'm taking my hair down i'm gonna go ahead and moisturize my hair i'm going to use the spray bottle i'm applying some water in larger sections and then we're going to be using the curl defining cream that i purchased from sally's a couple of months ago i still have about five jars of that stuff you guys along with the jamaican mango and lime locking gel i'm going to go ahead look i'm not going to flat twist i'm not even going to try it i'm going to go ahead and set my hair in medium to medium small twists and i will be applying perm rods in about two more days i decided to leave these twists in for three more days that is one of the ways that i ensure that i get a very defined twist out i leave the twists in for a couple of days okay and i also ensure that my ends are properly detangled I'm just about done here twisting my hair down. I will apologize in advance. My child is gonna be in some of this footage. I'm showing you how I'm going to be adding the perm rods. It's getting a little tricky to record with my son home all day. So here I am three days later. I added the perm rods, but only up to um, halfway of my hair. Now, as I start to take down these twists, they it is a little frizzy. And I do think that's a combination of the product along with me not using any oil to help to unravel. I felt like at the time I didn't need any oil because I was touching my hair and it felt moisturized. It actually felt a little oily. So I just didn't think that, you know, I just didn't feel like there was a need to add more oil to my hair because I didn't want it to be heavy. Um, so I'm just gonna continue to separate my hair and unravel, okay?
right, you guys. So, yeah, you can see how it's a little frizzy or you can see the frizziness on this side. Um, I'm going to, I still think it's great definition. Now, I'm not going to deny that. Great def definition, excuse me. Going to fluff up my hair. Y'all know me, I like big hair. So, this is what the final results look like. Yeah, a little frizzy on the ends, but that's okay. I'm still going to rock it. I'm going to turn around to the back. Yeah, frizz city. <laughs> Honestly, you guys, I could correct this. I, I think I know what I could do next time. Um, use a heavier leave-in conditioner with the lock and gel and oil to unravel. But that is it, you guys. I hope you enjoyed this video. Thank you so much for watching. Take care. Bye.